Lil Dirk. Lil Dirk, you know, versus Mr. Young, young Boy. <sighs> this is a it's a it's a, it's like a it's like difficult to me, bro. Because I mean, I'm I'm grown. I'm not taking those sides, but I love both of their music. But it's like, man, I don't even know where to start at with them. It's just uh, I just don't understand it, bro. Like, what you mean? Like, I'm just I'm just trying to, cause I'm I'm really not up to par on the whole story like that. Maybe you can fill me in on um, this little controversy well, between them well, Dirk, and why people trying to really, people really choosing sides now. Well, uh, Dirt, mm -hmm. um, artist was King Von, uh, young boy artist is Quando Rondo. Gotcha. Quando Rondo hangs with Lil Tim, I think they some relation or something like that. Mm -hmm. King Von got in the fight with Quando Rondo. Lil Tim got out the car and shot King Von. King Von and King Von died. Now this is Young Boy artist, mm -hmm. so Young Boy gotta gotta you know ride with his artist. Right. Uh, King Von is Dirk's best friend and his artist, which King Von was definitely on the rise at the time. He'd probably be one of the biggest artists right now if he was alive. Mm, okay. Now uh, it's all making sense. Cause I remember that situation, but I just then I I couldn't put the whole story together. Yeah. So now 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 it all makes so sense. So now yeah. you know, Quando Rondo's a way smaller artist than than no disrespect to Quando, but he's a smaller artist than than Young Boy. He's right. his, he's his artist, but he's not on Young Boy's level. Well, with King Bun is gone, mm -hmm. uh, rest his soul. You know, but you know, Dirk is still here, and Dirk and Young mm -hmm. Boy is basically on the same level, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So, young boy kind of took up that, you know, and there's some girls involved and shit like that too, but we ain't gonna get all into that, you yeah. know what I'm saying? But it's, it's Dirt kind of took up that, you know, that beef with them, mm -hmm. and and young boy kind of took up that beef for his side. So now it's just back and forth, tick for tat, who, who's better, and, and Dirt has a fan base that's growing very, very strong and very, very fast. Mm -hmm. um, Actually, compared to Young Boy, what was even more amazing is that King Von's, I think how you say it, posthumous album this week outsold Young Boy and the Baby album by double. Wow! So damn, it's like Young, it's like Dirk's fan base is growing very, very fast. Mm -hmm. It's 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 like on online. It's you know, for the past couple of years. People will, if you say something about an artist who you like, man, that nigga, you know, whoever, mm -hmm. such and such is dope, bro. People will put in your comments, why be better? Right. And if you're not up to what's going on, they mean young boy better. Mm -hmm. And they'll kill you with that all day. But now they starting to say Lil Dirt better. Mm -hmm. Like, so it's really just back and forth. I say this, man. All y'all consumers out there that's picking sides between grown ass niggas who are rich, who don't give a fuck about none of this shit, y'all are some fucking dummies. Mm. I'm not picking Thanks. a side between these two niggas who drive them around in Maybachs and shit like that. They don't give a fuck. They really don't. Like, like when, when no time in hip hop have you ever had to pick a side to suffer, but pick Biggie and Tupac, mm -hmm. you, you didn't have to pick a side then. Mm -mm. If I went, like I had both of them niggas albums. I didn't give a fuck about that shit. Like y'all, right. like, like y'all listening to these niggas and taking these niggas way too literal. Like, uh, too too serious. Like, oh, you know, I, I'm riding with this, 4K Trey and, oh, OTF and all this other shit. Mm -hmm. Like, bro, I don't give a fuck about none of that shit. I'll say this. I think Young Boy is the hottest nigga out here. That's my personal opinion. Mm -hmm. Now, Dirk finna drop on the 11th. Uh, whenever, yeah, the 11th, I think. Yeah. If Dirk got them do some crazy fucking numbers... And and he move he's moving a certain way now. Don't get it twisted. Yeah. But if Dirk do some crazy numbers, I have no problem coming back on this same podcast saying Dirk is the hottest nigga out here. Yeah. You know, Dirk is in top three, guaranteed. Mm -hmm. um, but I just I just say young boy because his shit is different. It ain't the same, bro. A lot of y'all niggas need social media. He ain't even on that shit for real. Wait a minute. So you think not not to try to be on some comparison type shit, but you think uh, Lil Durk and NBA um, is above Lil Baby? We can't forget about Lil Baby now. 
I think look, I think NBA Young Boys is number one organically the hottest artist out here. Yeah. Even above Little Baby. Yeah, I think NBA Young Boys is the hottest mm. artist out here. Okay. Your baby ain't dropped in two years, maybe three years now. I mean, yeah, he's doing features and killing yeah. features, but Lil Baby ain't dropping in three years. Look here, brother, just put out just put out this shit today. Most streamed artists in the US so far. March 10th, 2022. Number one, Drake, 1.4 billion. Mm. Number two, NBA Youngboy, 1.3 billion. Taylor Swift, Damn. three. Weekend, four. Juice World, five. Kanye West, six. Eminem, seven. Uh, Kodak Black, eight. Rod Wave, nine. Megan Wallen, whoever that is. Not the, no, not the style. I didn't say mm -hmm. Waylon. Uh, ten. What the fuck is Lil Dirt? What the fuck that's is Lil Dirt? That's amazing. And you don't even see him. Who? Uh, NBA young boy. You don't even see him. No, you see him. No, no, I'm saying you see him, but I'm talking about he not he not using social platforms no. okay, like the saying. other artists. You get what I'm saying? Okay. So it's like that's amazing. Like but what? You like that. right there with Drake with no social platform, people just fucking with you but, just but, because but you see, as the artist. But yeah. see, that's what I'm saying, bro. Like it's been like that for years. Like young boy, y'all realize he dropped the first take in 15. Yeah. When 38 Baby came out, his shit skyrocketed. Like, like I remember when him and him and Twenty One Savage beefing now. I remember when him and Twenty One Savage was, was Twenty One Savage one of the first niggas to work with him on murder. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So like, that, that that's why I say, bro. Like, it's different, bro. Like it's that shit. Like it, it's so many different. Number one on YouTube. Yo, yeah, we like, really like, like, YouTube. this ain't even YouTube. This is just streams. This yeah. is just downloading and listening to his music. Like, it's it's just the most organic shit I've seen. Mm -hmm. Now, I say this: Do he come out and always do huge numbers? No, because he ain't, the machine ain't really putting money behind him. Yeah. You know what I mean? But do he do his numbers? Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. I feel like uh, him and him and the baby's album. That's kind of a flop. It surprised mm -hmm. me. Yeah, but it's kind of a flop. I don't know why. Maybe the baby have a lot of shit going on. People don't want to support him. Yeah. Uh, maybe young boy got a lot of shit going on. It may be, maybe I don't know. maybe maybe it was just the wrong timing of them doing it. I don't think it was like you know like like Jay Z said when he made that Watch the Throne with Kanye. You know everything sometimes just based on timing. Mm -hmm. You just can't force shit all the time. I don't really know what space both of them was in. Of course, uh, the baby. He been having his little altercations with his with his baby mama and other little shit going on even before that. Um, but and of course, why be he got his situation, why he always where he at? And it's just like, I just I don't know. I don't I can't I listen to the album and I just I don't know if they was in the right space mentally, just me listening to. It. I mean, they had a couple decent tracks on there, but it was overall, to me, it wasn't a good body of work, honestly. I fuck with it. I ain't gonna say it was just good. No, no, I mean, it's, I mean, like I said, they had a few songs, but just the body of it, it just, I thought it was gonna be like 10 times better than what it is. Just from me listening to them individually, you would think like, oh shit, they, like that moment when Ye and Jay-Z making the song, like we we know the track record for both of these. We know that shit gonna be fire. So in my head, I'm just thinking like, well, I know this shit gonna be fire. I say, I'm but say when I listened to it, it was like, now, I ain't five, but I mean, it, it, I mean, it's solid. My, my it a little different, yeah. bro. I ain't gonna lie to you. Like, I really didn't like watch the throne like that. That's just me. I know they, I know, yeah, yeah. I don't give a fuck about what I know they're gonna say. I, I understand how people think watch the throne or people say it was great, that this and that. I mm -hmm. get that. I'm not saying it wasn't great. I just personally, eh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, I don't think YB and the baby shit was great either. Yeah, I just think it was pretty good. It was okay, you know what I'm saying. I mean, you yeah. know, I think it had twelve songs on it. It was just okay, you yeah. know. So it was, it was, it was straight. You know, so I, I ain't had to just skip too many. I ain't had to skip right. them like one or two songs. Uh, I, I, I do agree with the timing. Timing was very. I do believe that the timing was kind of off on it. You know what I mean? Um, yeah, it just really, it really just came with, out with of everything nowhere. That, yeah. With everything they got going on. Now yeah. I will say this: they didn't have no push from nobody. They just dropped it. It shit. came out of nowhere. Like, no, no, they've been talking about it though. They've been talking yeah. about it. They, they, I mean, they, I didn't, I didn't really, you know what I mean? Yeah, I mean, you, you, like I say, bro, you have to catch wind of young boy shit. Just, yeah. Just no, no, not with him. I'm just saying, like, I didn't even know they was in. I mean, I know they do songs and shit together. I'm just thinking like they putting shit out, but I ain't really think they was gonna do a collab album like that. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't see it coming. They've been working together for a minute. 
Yeah. Okay. But I, 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 get what I you ain't mean. see the collab coming though, but I see what you're saying. Yeah, but I mean, you know, it's, it's, like I say, man, I just wish, you know, uh, Dirk and Young Boy, you know, it, it ain't gonna happen. You know what? I ain't gonna sit up and talk to you. Don't y'all. say that, because it ain't gonna happen. Yeah, I ain't gonna sit up and talk to y'all. Nigga. Y'all nigga do what y'all gonna do. Shoot shit, whatever. I don't give a fuck. But, um, I will say Dirk is climbing, man. Like, mm-hmm. like he's 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 climbing. But for the mere fact that Young Boy is that high on the streams chart, yeah. like number two behind Drake, and we know Drake got the biggest machine ever, right? Like label, whatever, team, you call it everything, team, all of that shit. And they got fucking private jets and shit. And to be right behind him like that, that's why I was like, wow. Yeah, but that's like, why yeah. I don't say Drake is the hottest because he's been around twelve years, mm-hmm. whatever. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, he's damn near legend status. Now. Yeah. So I don't really include him in that. You gotta realize, young boy, and them like 22, bro, 21, 22, like that's that's some different shit. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So to for him to even, bro, that's that's like I say, man, that's that's some different shit. Like I say, mm-hmm. I will say this, it's getting close. Cause Dirk is Dirk and 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 don't get it twisted, Lil Baby dropped tomorrow. He gonna be through the roof, especially if he got one song like tomorrow a hit on mm-hmm. them. If he dropped tomorrow, little baby shit going straight through the fucking roof. You already know. You know what I mean? So <sighs> it's tough. But as far as the YB battle, little dirt battle, we we gonna see. Little dirt drops. I want to say the eleven. I'm not sure. Mm-hmm. Let's see what his first week numbers look like. We gonna really know when he dropped on the eleven. Um, because people been waiting on him. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's it's. It's going to be interesting. But then right after that, young boy dropping his last album uh on the label. You know that shit going through the room. Go, go, go dropping later on this month. Yeah. So let's see if let's see if they gonna put some money behind young boy. Let's just once that happens, let's compare who sells is what. You know what I'm yeah. saying? But I can guarantee you young boy by himself gonna do more than what him and the baby did. Oh, yeah, you know definitely. I mean, um, this shit, I mean, come on now. Yeah, man, I mean, those brothers, I hope they get it together, man. Yeah. I hope they get it together.